Welcome to Facts for Real Videos. The largest solar farm in the world to the tallest train bridge. India has achieved significant advancements in mega projects and contemporary technology. So, having read a lot of it is finally time for the top 10 mega projects in India based on your feedback over the past few years. We start with number 10. A Chinab bridge with a $180 million price tag Many of India's current megaprojects are intended to improve connectivity between various regions. The Chinab is one such endeavor. Bridge in the contentious Jammu and Kashmir area. At a height of 359 meters over the Chinab the tallest railway bridge in the world. River it is taller than the Eiffel Tower. Prior to the bridge's construction, Kashmir could only be reached by land. The national route connecting Jammu and Srinagar to the rest of the county. However, the harsh winters have a significant influence on this one route, which is closed for a few months. Every year, weeks. Fortunately, when it opens, the new Chinab Bridge will solve that issue. Towards the latter part of this year, the bridge will open up a new land route in addition to serve strategic objectives as well as provide India more power over the region. We move on to number 9. $380 million the Palais Royal in Mumbai, Mumbai, India's financial center is also its center for skyscrapers, being the location of practically all of the nation's skyscrapers. The tallest of all of them is the, the completion of the 320-meter tall Palais Royal, which has been delayed for years. The first ultra-tall skyscraper in the nation's history began its construction in 2008 to much excitement. It was intended to be a residential skyscraper designed to entice the expanding elite of the city. However, several litigation involving the construction caused delays and cost overruns. Construction continued throughout all of the legal proceedings, and the structure was eventually completed. In 2018. Then, however, interior and exterior construction were again put on hold. The building was sold at auction a year later for just $85 million, following which the nation's top court once more endorsed building. While building has continued, uncertainties still exist. Regarding the high rise's practicality and its potential habitation, most recent date for the Palais Royale's completion is scheduled for December 2023, by which time it would have blown through a $380 million budget. But in contrast to the subsequent mega projects, these expenses are very controllable. Number 8. Projects for the Zoji, La and Z, More Tunnel, $1.2 billion A billion dollar project that involves drilling is also going to Kashmir. Tunnels to link Ladakh with the valley. The most significant two tunnels are Zojila on the Srinagar. Le Road, and Z, Moor, Srinagar and will be connected by the Z, Moor Tunnel. Ladakh provides a 6.5 kilometer link that allows access to these areas during the winter. The land Srinagar will be connected by the 14 kilometers Ojila Tunnel. This tunnel is currently constructed in the most difficult terrain in India, near the Zojila Pass. At 3,500 meters above sea level, it will rank among the world's tallest car tunnels. The two tunnels' construction will be completed by 2024, with plans for network expansion from the government already in place for the ensuing years. Number 7. Project for the Mumbai Coastal Road. $1.7 billion in addition to Ultra High Towers. Mumbai is currently undergoing significant infrastructure improvements. In 2023, for metropolitan commuters, congestion is a huge pain because the typical vehicle the speed limit is 25 km per hour or less. However, a few initiatives will alter how the foreseeable future will see travel to Mumbai. With $1.7 billion in costs, the city will receive a 29-kilometer beachfront road with an average speed of a speed of 80 km h Twin tunnels measuring 2 km each are also included on the route. Indian Ocean. The project's initial phase, which is 10 km long and connects Princess Flyover Road. By the end of the year, traffic will be allowed on the 75% finished Whirly Sea Link. Number 6. $2.3 billion Navi Mumbai International Airport This project is an element of the solution to Mumbai's traffic problem. Because they are the nation's Mumbai, India's financial center and its most visited city, has just one significant international airport. Airport. More than 50 million people can use the Mumbai International Airport each year. Yet most days is at full capacity. The extent of the extension is limited by the availability of only one runway. Airlines have had trouble finding slots for additional flights because space is currently restricted at the location. A private conglomerate took on the challenge to address the problem and reduce congestion at the current airport. The 2017 project of building a new airport. The project's first phase will be finished after that. 
20 million fewer travelers will use the city's primary airport each year. The, the remaining phases will be implemented during the following 10 years, increasing the cost of construction to a total of $23 billion. Eventually, the Navi Mumbai Airport would have a capacity of a 90 million passenger capacity, making it one of the world's busiest airports. Despite the airport's ability to significantly reduce traffic, some aviation experts and activists disagree. Suppose a better location could have been selected given how dangerously the current One Drops airplanes are exposed to bird strikes because of their proximity to significant bird sanctuaries. Next up we have number 5. Dollar 2. For billion for the Mumbai Trans Harbour link the 22-kilometer. Redesigned transportation infrastructure includes a significant increase as well. 6. Lane Sea Bridge linking Navi Mumbai and Central Mumbai. Why a sea link is necessary has always existed to connect Mumbai with significant cities like Nagpur. Goa, and Pune. However, the first four efforts and no real ideas were made until 2004. Construction failed to get off the ground because to overly high bids from several contractors. Why a sea link is necessary has always existed to connect Mumbai with significant cities like Nagpur, Goa, and Pune. However, the first four efforts and no real ideas were made until 2004. Construction failed to get off the ground because to overly high bids from several contractors. Finally, the Maharashtra government granted two different contracts to construct in 2018 the Trans Harbour Link. This approach has assisted in removing building delays and in just five years, the link is ready for traffic. It is anticipated to deal with 70 people beginning in 2024. Thousands of vehicles per day traveling at speeds of up to 100 km h Number 4. $3.2 billion dollar a solar park India's recent ascent as a tech power progress in the renewable energy sector has been seen over the years. The authorities has set a lofty goal of producing 175 gigawatts of power from renewable sources. Sources in the ensuing years, and the dollar a solar park is an important part of that strategy. The endeavor within the broader dollar a smart city project is being developed in two phases and will it will eventually generate 5 gigawatts of energy making it the biggest solar park on Earth. The project's initial stage is currently being developed and will be finished by the year's conclusion. Although the entire project is anticipated to be finished by 2030 at a total costing more than $3 billion. So this would much aid our channel if you have enjoyed it thus far. Number 3. $8.2 billion Sardar Saravar Dam The huge population of India continues to be a serious concern for the distribution of water resources. The Nation the Nirmada Valley Development Project, which aims to alleviate these concerns, towards building a system of reservoirs, canals, and dams in the Nirmada River Basin. The plan, which was first put up in the 1940s, called for the construction of numerous dam and canal projects. On the valley side, however, as with most proposals for the delivery of water and electricity, the project has been the focus of debate because to its social and environmental effects for decades. The Sardar Saravar Dam which is being built over the basin, is the largest of these dams. Started in 1987, 30 more years were needed to complete environmental initiatives and drawn out judicial battles, which was first put up in the 1940s, called for the construction of numerous dam and canal projects. On the valley side, however, as with most proposals for the delivery of water and electricity, the project has been the focus of debate because to its social and environmental effects for decades. The Sardar Saravar Dam which is being built over the basin, is the largest of these dams. Started in 1987, 30 more years were needed to complete environmental initiatives and drawn out judicial battles, conflicts and conflicts between opposing governments. The one 450 megawatt hydropower plant was ultimately project's $8.2 billion building cost was finally unveiled in 2017. For Indian states presently receive irrigation and electricity from the dam. Number 2. $11 billion in Gujarat's gift city India hopes to build on recent successes. To compete with major financial hubs like those in the United States and the United Kingdom Singapore. 2. The initiative is being led by Gujarat International Finance Tech, City, which draws the world's largest financial players. Building the $11 billion company a district that includes banks, capital market organizations, insurance businesses, as well as factories. There are already more than 200 active business entities on the 900-acre facility where $4 billion are exchanged daily on global markets. Major the Bombay Stock Exchange, Brokers Forum, and other businesses are tenants in the Special Economic Zone, together with the National Stock Exchange. Additionally, it is where India's first bullion exchange is located. 
will aid the major gold importers in the world in international price setting. India's largest tech cluster, now referred to as a smart city, will soon with the government opening the way to increase its size, it will become the gift global city. India, meanwhile, is preparing a mega project that will be twice as expensive and even more massive in scope. Number 1. $22 billion for dollar a smart city as a component of the multi-billion Delhi, Mumbai this project, industrial corridor, is progressing quickly. Dollar a smart city's facilities expressways, high, speed trains, a new international airport, and more. It'll host significant manufacturing sectors include aerospace, defense, and electronics. The city will be 1.5 times the size of Mumbai overall, and it is anticipated to host more than 2,000 persons. Work on the first phase is still proceeding for the time being, with the main emphasis on, and it is anticipated to host more than 2,000 persons. Work on the first phase is still proceeding for the time being, with the main emphasis on enhancing the core business district's infrastructure. The next stages include development, altering the city's terrain and incorporating nearly 200 individuals into a developing civilization. The project will be finished in six parts over the course of 15 years. The mood is set by Dalara for eight additional industrial cities projected to change India's metropolitan landscape landscape. Despite the seeming glitz, India's vast, smart, city programs have drawn a lot of attention. Much of criticism. Critics assert that initiatives like Dalara Smart City are the outcome of given lower returns than the capital required to create and run, of utopian urban planning them. The risk of allocating resources to such initiatives is also that existing initiatives will be ignored. Urban areas that urgently need improvements. However, the Narendra Modi led administration appears despite the criticism. More money has been set aside for these improvements. What mega project do you find to be the most impressive? Which should we discuss any other Indian projects? Inform us in the comments below. We appreciate your interest and hope to see you at the next one. We appreciate your interest and hope to see you at the next one.